Nine on your side's Max Darrow and photojournalist Alfonso Sagoon tell us how Casa Video has survived the test of time. In go the people. How you doing? Out go the movies. In go the movies. Out go the people with more movies. A weekly family ritual that barely exists anywhere. Can we do this one? But it still thrives at one spot in Tucson. Casa Video. It amazes us too that we're still here. It really, it really does. Co-owner Gayla Schwab speculates a few things are behind it. The addition of a bar, one of the driving forces. And we have special packages that you know you get a growler and you get you know two for one movies. Then there's movie selection. I think we're in the range of about 60,000 different titles. Thousands more, she says, stocked on her shelves. More than you'd ever imagine to find on demand. So you might find Casablanca on Netflix one year and then not the next. So then you have to buy another subscription to another service so you can watch that movie if that's what you want to watch. I don't know, sometimes maybe it's just easier to come down to your local video store and, and find your movie. But the other thing that's helped this spot stand the test of time, loyal customers. Yeah, this is the last of the holdouts. Like Philip Ponce. Red tax in the new release. You see, to him, shopping for the movie, not scrolling for a movie, enhances his two hours of peace, time spent immersed in a fictional universe away from the struggles of day-to-day -day reality. Come here and get a movie, and uh, you forget about what went on that day at work. And uh, for me, a movie takes me, uh, it's almost like meditation. Schwab wants to be there to provide that to people like Ponce. Right now, she still can. She doesn't know what the future will bring, but she still sees a bright one for Casa Video. The industry has been saying we were going to die for a long, long, long time now. Um, and I think we just refuse to just lay down quietly. Max Darrow, KGUN 9, on your side. Very well said, shopping for the movie. You remember when we used to shop yes. for VHS movies, that experience? Oh yeah, experience? that's where it all began, right? <laughs> then it went to DVD and, well, they're the last holdout and I'm glad they're still around. Glad to see that, yep. yeah.